So let's look at some of the issues that have popped up recently. A recent declassified Freedom of Information Act from the Project on Government Accountability found a report that was briefed to key members of the Senate and House Armed Services Committee talking about some of the system issues with the F-35. And there were four main areas that it highlighted. The first issue with the F-35 was its availability rate. Next were issues surrounding maintenance. The third issue around its 25 millimeter cannon and accuracy issues. And finally delays with improvements, which we'll talk about the TR, the technology refresh here in just a minute. But first, some of the specific problems that the report dug into was the fact that the plane is smart and it monitors itself and systems. When parts are breaking or need to be replaced, it's smart enough to notify maintenance crews ahead of time or when they download the information post-flight of what needs to be fixed. However, it triggered a fault rate on false reports one per hour of flight. It was designed to trigger no more than one per 50 hours. So that failure rate is through the roof, thus creating tons of more maintenance requirement, man hours to work and maintain these jets on problems that aren't really there. Additionally, there are critical component failures that are failing at a rate that should not be occurring. All this driving the availability rate of the aircraft, and that is the real important piece, meaning that if the aircraft is not available to fly, pilots can't fly it, thus they can't train and be ready to go out there and fight. F-35 is stealth low observable. 